everyone, welcome to Everyday Affairs, where we bring you all trending news and information on things happening around the world. I appreciate every one of you who has subscribed to this channel. However, if you're yet to subscribe, kindly click on the subscribe button on the right hand side of your screen, written in red, subscribe, and also hit the bell icon by its side so that you can get notification whenever a new story is published. Thank you and stay tuned. Hello viewers and listeners, we'll bring you another interesting news this time around and it says, Yoruba leaders kick against open grazing. Governors of the six states of the Southwest Zone yesterday reaffirmed their stand against open grazing in the region and called on the federal government to reintroduce ranches for the purposes of cattle rearing and others. This is even as eminent personalities and leaders of thought in Yoruba land called for the abolition of open grazing in Yoruba land. Chairman of the Southwest Governors Forum and Governor of Ondo State, Rotimi Akeridolu, who spoke on behalf of others during a condolence visit to the late to the leader of the Pan Yoruba Social Cultural Group, Afeniferi Chief Ruben Fasorati in Akure, the Ondo State capital, said the six governors of Oyo, Oshun, Ekiti, Ondo, Lagos, and Ogun State are tired of the evils being perpetrated by Fulani headsmen. Although the Osho State Governor, Bwinga Oyetola, was absent, Akere Dolu said he had earlier spoken with him on the position of the other governors and he had his mandate to speak. The governors who were in Akure for the burial of Mrs. Funke Olakonri, Fasunati's daughter, declared that an end will come to insecurity in the region, going by the efforts they are making. Akere Dolu specially said the governors had resolved to take drastic measures to end killings and kidnapping in the southwest adding that the forests in the region are used as hiding places by the bandits. But he said the forests will not be destroyed because they are pride of the region and said the government of the state will further encourage forestation. However, he said he had directed the police commissioner in Ondo State to direct his men to embark on 24 hours patrol rather than being on the checkpoint, adding that other governors in the region have done similar things that he posited would end the menace of insecurity in the region. The governor also called for the collaboration of all citizens in the fight against insecurity in the region. A leader of Afeniferi Ayo Adebanjo condemned the activities of the Fulani headsmen and urged the governors to collectively fight the menace of insecurity ravaging the region. Also, former Minister of Aviation Femi Fanikayode said, the position of the governors is fully implemented, if fully implemented, would help in the fight against insecurity. Adding, I pray the governors have the courage to present their position to President Muhammad Buhari. If it is true that there are full and vigilantes operating in the southwest and mountain roadblocks, then it is a recipe for disaster and a precursor to war. Our people will not take it. If they are really there, they should get out of the southwest and go and do their vigilante in the north. We have not been annexed by the Fulani. We are not an occupied territory and neither are we slaves, he said. All right, viewers and listeners, what are your thoughts on this particular news story about uh, the Yoruba leaders kicking against open grazing? Well, it has long been said and people have kicked against it and um, we want to hear what your thoughts are on this particular issue uh, and this particular news story. Kindly leave a comment at the comment section on what your thoughts are. Thank you.